back to the Absolution Hall. But at some time, we have to figure out how to work visiting across rivers and Jane into our routine as well, into our journey. Oh my god, okay, that's new. A Nihilist ambush. A group of hostile Nihilists approach, dead set on the head of the Marked Wolf, looking specifically for me. It is the Marked Wolf, just as we foresaw. <laughs> my horse! If he lives, the West will fall. We cannot let it happen. Come, friends. We know how this will end if we let him escape. Okay. Oh, jeez. Oh! That's beautiful. Hey, if we do... Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, it makes them bleed. If I use the rolling button... Oh, that's really good. They killed other people here before me. Onira Spirit Walker. Three stars. You're getting kind of dangerous here. Hmm. Gonna take all the meat I can get. Oh my god, that's another werewolf. Devotee. Oh. Ah! Oh, that vulture. Mm, we gotta keep our health in mind a little bit now. So I'm gonna spend more time just eating random cactuses. Oh! That was an accident. Yes. They believe they're doing the right thing. But what really is the right thing? Nobody really knows, right? And the right thing might be different for different people. So there's really no way to tell. Oh. Do you guys have space? Yeah, the one thing about the branded people that are better than the non-branded companions is that they have a bigger inventory. Because we have 48, but the companions have like 32 or something. I like Gregory though. It's really nice to have another fellow werewolf here. Someone who understands the plight, you know? But I'm kind of wary of giving him too much stuff because I feel like I understand that I won't be... Yeah, it's pretty likely that I'll probably end up with somebody else, Jane or Across Rivers. One or the other. It's a lot of amulets. Oh my gosh. Maybe we can sell them later on. Okay. Oh, I'll take that. Thank God for cactuses. Thank you. All right. Bird Call Hills. This whole place is basically farms, mines, and churches, apparently. I'm back, Franciscus. We have a problem with Layla. What? Essex! Frankie. Can I call you Frankie? Listen, I got money. And an object. Just wanna have a little chat with that branded wolf of yours. The marked wolf ain't a sideshow. Answers no. Frankie, them witches is slaughtering y'all. You need the coin. Recruit some new wolves, install some anemones. You know, start with a wash tub, go from there. Time you left, outlaw. Well now, ain't I a lucky boy? Here's just the wolf I was looking for. I'm Essex Mast, researcher of the occult and seeker of immortality. Let me guess, your knife been giving you fits? Devotee, you made it back. But Layla, where is she? Layla turned moon drunk and fled. Oh, floods! Desi, she did? Oh, time for you to leave, outlaw. This ain't for your ears. Am I dumb? Why did I say that in front of Essex? Bet you're great at parties, Frankie. Hey, friend. You want to talk about that brand some more? Meet me outside, here? 
Y'all take care now. Before she went missing, Leila sent us a relay. Location of the Blood Moon Temple. The Authority and her witches will be looking for her, trying to get that Blood Moon location for themselves. We gotta find Layla before they do. Last time she went moon drunk, she ended up in her hometown, Grackle. Oh! Start there, and hope she ain't burned the place to ash already. Layla's the best y'all got. Prophecy needs her. Back to Grackle to find her then. Your old stomping grounds. Grackle. Franciscus was right about you, devotee Desi. A whole mind of witches by yourself? Not by myself. I had some help. Still curious about the whatever's beneath your- Oh! Uh, but is he gonna get mad if I do this? I won't keep secrets. Not from you. You wanna look around down there? I ain't gonna stop you. Just... Keep an open mind here. Oh! What opened? Oh! Whoa, jeez! Oh! Uh. Well, there's a purse. What? The heck? <gasps> there's an Aniris here! It's you, the marked wolf. I expected this. I have had visions of this meeting. Who are you? I am Sybil. As you can see, I'm an Anirist. Actually, how was I able to tell? Oh, because she has a branding on her forehead. But mostly because of her earrings, because all the Anirists seem to be like female and... Are there... are there male Anirists? We've mostly seen female ones so far. But I'm a friend of Franciscus, of the Spirit Hall, and of you, Marked One. I want to see the Anirus genocide fail as much as you do. What my kin do, it is wrong. So I use my gift, my ability to see the future, to assist Franciscus and your hounds in this war. The Blood Moon Prophecy. It was not Franciscus's vision. It was mine. Oh! No, I believe it. I believe it. He's a devotee, right? He doesn't necessarily have these powers, but we know that Anirists do. But that means that Franciscus has been lying to everybody. Deception. That is a curious word for what Franciscus did. Would you be so virtuous if you knew that deception saves the lives of your people? The prophecy has given your people hope, has it not? Your abilities as a werewolf have given you a fighting chance, have they not? Franciscus only wants to see his people survive. The prophecy could just as easily have come from your gods. It just so happens it came from an anirist. Try and stretch your mind, Marked One, to see the forest for the trees. Your devotees would be dead, were it not for Franciscus' willingness to take a chance on my vision. Suddenly it makes sense then why both sides have visions about the Blood Moon Temple. Because it's the same vision. Hmm. Tell me more about the Blood Moon Prophecy. It is all unfolding as I envisioned. Transform the devoted into wolves. Have the marked one bring a wolf army to the temple to activate the Blood Moon. If this is done, your people will be saved. We should ask her more. Why do you want to help us? So, a witch, right at the heart of the spirit hall. At the heart of the prophecy. How do you square that? Franciscus might need a talking to. I'm gonna be having that now. Thank you. Sybil, I, I think I need to, um, you know, I just need to have a more of a word with you. Surely the Authority will take notice of me soon. If they have visions... Fallen Anirist. You seek guidance, Marked One? We need to question her more. Oh. Requires lightning power to open. Lightning power? Is that something I can invest into? Healing? 
Strength? No. Lightning rounds? I can shoot a bullet. No, I just don't have it. Whatever it is. Healing. Recover 100% more hit points when using bandages. Nah, let's do something like reload more with firearms. Increase fire rate during dodge leap. That's a really good one. We'll leave it at that for now. Or maybe I'll even do this. Sure. Lightning power. Oh, there's a forge here. That's nice. But I don't think I need it. Or actually, I... Uh, oh! I was using a green shotgun the whole time. I can upgrade. These are different. This has two bullets, but... Yeah, the higher damage. I'll take the five bullet one. Letter to Sybil. Counting my sins now, <laughs> says the pigman to the werewolf. Sybil, need you to transform another devotee for me. I'll leave him nice and asleep at the door, with the silver and the wolf's bane. Need as many wolves as we can get. Your kind's slaughtering us. You sure the blood moon will save us? Oh, she's the one directly changing people into wolves. Oh my god. So in a way, our entire... Our entire people exists because of her. Wow. Oh no, I'm not gonna steal it. That's your bed. Horrors of the Ancients. The learned traveler of the spirit-blessed expanses of the West may remember seeing some sundry ruins from an ancient time rising up from the land. Consider, had these people obeyed the spirits, why should a nun's peace have abandoned them? Why should Yeb's change have swept them from the earth? Follow the spirits as guidance, gentle folk, lest ye meet the same fate. I kind of feel like a plaything then. If we're all... Oh, I'm so curious about this. You could disrupt the vision bumbling about like that. Well, sorry. Sorry. There's a book in that room. Well, I'll come back for it, if I ever get lightning power. Wow. Franciscus? May I speak to you privately? So, you found her, huh? Bound to happen. I won't keep no secrets. What's on your mind? I'm standing on the trap door. We know why she's hidden, because people will rage. Oh my god, the Relayogram clerk is listening in on us. <laughs> Why did you lie about the prophecy? Well, I... I know it wasn't exactly... honorable. But Desi, you got to understand. Everything Sybil said, it's come true. Creating Gavin's Hounds, Blood Moon Temple. You, your brand, it's all real. You think our devotees would have believed any of it if it came from a witch? Would Layla have believed it? Would you? I'd do whatever it took to protect our people from slaughter, Desi. You know that. Even if I got my soul dirty along the way. Oh, well... Hmm. How can you trust Sybil? Sybil wants peace. If she didn't, she would have killed me already. She sees the future. Sees how we'll all be slaughtered. And she wants the help. That's all. She's earned my trust, Desi. I hope she can earn yours. Why is she hidden? An Oniris helping us get the bulge on other Onirists? There's a nuance here most folk wouldn't understand. She's got to stay hidden, or it'll all fall apart. Now, let sleeping dogs lie, Desi. Yeah, so I get the impression that we're probably doing the most run-of-the-mill sort of playthrough of the story here, but they did mention in the beginning that it's possible for us to kill anybody here, even including main storyline characters. So we could totally try doing something like kill the Anirist. Not that I want to do that, but I think it's possible, is what I want to say. You know what? Actually, 
In the spirit of science, why don't we try that? I'll make a hard save right here. Like, I'm not gonna keep this, but just to show off that this game, I think experimentation is a important concept in trying to figure out like what's actually available. Yeah, so if I try to kill you. Major crime. Oh, 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 okay, so this lady might not let me kill her. She won't come back out. If I commit a crime, my reputation goes down. I see. Will Franciscus get mad? Oh my god! Oh, Franciscus, okay. Yo, my entire, my own absolutionist hall is angry with me. Right, so that, that didn't go so well. Why don't you just kill me here then? Fine. Oh, Pigman Joe! Oh. Well, that's one way to see our friends, huh? <laughs> okay, that was just for science. Yeah, it's not... Not quite viable for a... A playthrough where you want to see more story. Because if you kill people, then you, you inherently see less story. Because people are dead, right? So... But it's possible. Theoretically. Okay, Essex. Absolution this, absolution that. I was getting tired of hearing that cleric spout his nonsense. Wait a minute. That brand. What? You already knew. You knew I was here already. <laughs> well, looks like I found another one. Just like that bounty hunter, just like that pig, and the native hunter. Now a wolf. Hold on, I feel a joke coming on. Four branded folk walk into a saloon. The saloon girl says, Hey, we don't serve your kind here. And the pigman, intestines hanging around his neck, right? Turns to the wolf, fangs dripping with blood and all, and says, What you got against bounty hunters? Ha 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 ha. There you go, partner. Just cover your mouth next time. Them teeth are disturbing. You complain about everything about me. You complain about Clarence's snout, and now my teeth? Who do you think you are? The way he talks to me every single time, though, he talks to me as if he's talking to the individuals as opposed to me, the passenger. Even though he knows that the passenger is in the people because they have the brand. Listen, Moongazer, I've been hearing things of a disturbing variety. That there's some experiment them 21 are running. You know anything about that? I have heard about it. They're experimenting on me. Well, that confirms it. And I ain't like it one bit. Any experiment Dumb Immortals is running can't be good for the rest of us. Ain't no more time to waste. I gotta get my immortality in quick. Last thing I need before I find that Aleph is the soul vessel. And you know what? I think you could help me with it. There's a nymph relic in it for you if you help. Interested? Sure. Heard it's in the witch hideout called Oleander Temple. I hear you're already rooting out witches, so keep an eye out. You find it? I got a nymph relic with your name on it. What is a soul vessel? You pull a soul out of somebody, it's gotta go somewhere, right? Else it'll just fly right back in. This vessel, it traps a soul for good. When I find Aleph, I'm trapping that soul where it can't get out. Then I'm taking over. Sweet immortality. I can almost taste it. I don't think immortality is as good as you think it is. The little girls, uh, the mysterious girl, she's mentioned specifically about how, oh, I don't, I have no feeling. I'm immortal, but I don't feel anymore. I feel because, I think I feel? I, I feel because I'm in the bodies of these people. But, SX, do you really want that? Is that something you want? Well, that's for him to decide, I guess. Can I go back and sleep on a bed to get some free AP? A little bit far. Oh. Whoa. Okay, he's just practicing. Um, I needed to look for Sophia, right? Hmm. 
I don't know if that's like an actual quest though. Or just a side thing. And she was really upset about it before. Okay. And this person has a portrait, which makes me feel like she's important. She has Flora's portrait, actually. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about it then. We'll see. Okay, Essex. Uh, I don't know. I really don't feel too good about Essex becoming immortal, but I'll follow along just to see what happens. We need to see. Oh, I can take a horse. There's my horse. Grackle! They recommended me to go to. Of all places. Well, this would be a good time to go visit Jane, but oh, I like Gregory. I like Clarence. I like Jane. <laughs> Let's go here first. I think Jane... Well, it's cool to have transforming people here. So I guess that's why Jane is weaker, because she's human! But Clarence... Clarence got his pig powers. And Gregory's got his werewolf powers. Yeah, okay, maybe this time I will let Jane rest for real then. But I want to talk to her just to get the... Um, the dialogue. Hey, Alonzo! I ain't digging one more grave. I ain't doing it. Where is... what's his face? I forgot his name. Donald. <laughs> You're one of Franciscus's moon gazers, huh? I've been getting a lot of strange visitors lately. Let me guess. Yup. You got the brand too, just like I thought. Okay, this is the exact same dialogue as before. Yeah. Same dialogue. It's, it's a bit of a shame. You would hope that it would actually do something, but this, um, this story, Weird West, is more about... Yeah, it's more about uh, being able to do like the freedom of choice and all that, so... Whenever you have stuff like that, I guess it means that story beats get a little bit harder to account for. Because they don't know who you'll bring to any story, so they can't really write any additional dialogue for it. Do I want any of this? I might want the sigil stone. I'll take all of that. Your wedding band. The yeah, amulet of rising blood. That'd be excellent. I think we're good for now. The bow? You certainly don't need a bow. Yeah, I think this time I'll, I'll let Jane rest for real. So, give me that. I don't think I even need to take all this stuff. That's a lot of stuff. And my inventory is like so full again. Okay. Thank you, Jane. But you should rest. You should rest. That's it? But we ain't find our answers yet. Well, I'm not gonna beg. If you need me, you know where to find me. I know we didn't find our answers yet, but... There are no answers. No manners on you. Sorry. I can kill you, you know. I can kill you, but I of course I'm not gonna do it. Gregory? Welcome back. What did I just send over? All the junk? Scrap this. Yeah, we good. Okay, rest well, Jane. Rest well. I want you to spend quality time with your husband and all that. But Calamity... I guess I'll take Calamity. To Grackle. Ugh. Too fucking hot. Hey, I didn't take Calamity. Caring for Layla. When you find Layla, be careful. 
She's bloodthirsty as a wraith when she's moon drunk. Say her name a time or two. Remind her who she is. She'll come back to you. Shouts and murmurs. Commotion. Trouble heavy in the air like thunderheads. Shit, she really was moon drunk. I almost hope she's not here though, because if she is, then the people in town... This town has already suffered a massacre at the hand of the Stillwaters, so I don't think they could... They could relive that again. Yeah, I don't need bars. I need nuggets so I can upgrade. I don't have enough for any sort of upgrades. Larry. Hey, where's your wife, Larry? You're looking for Layla's house? Caddy cornered from the sheriff's office. But didn't you hear what happened? What? What happened? Sheriff's office? Nice to get indoors a little while. Mm -hmm. $30 a pop. That's pretty good. Yeah, we got a good bit of blue weapons now. It's not really... something we're missing too much of anymore. Which is good. Purple weapons, we also got a whole bunch. Like, a whole bunch. Clarence, do you want a purple cleaver? A gold cleaver, excuse me. Might be good for you. Yeah, otherwise I think we're okay. Thanks. Clarence? We were meant to meet. I wish I could bring everybody. I really love Jane. Yeah, give me all that. Equip the cleaver. But everybody being melee, I'm not sure if that's... That's like a good idea. Because Gregory is probably pretty melee when he turns into a... Whoa! I see a werewolf, I kill it. The hell? Marie, my poor sister. Some kind of zombie curse. Spirits think I'm wolf people. I'll kill every last one of them. What happened? My sister Marie. That fucking werewolf killed her right where she stood. They've been everywhere lately. Came and attacked my property the other night too. If I see another one of them wolf people, I'll kill it. And I got practice too. I'll hunt them beasts and put them down. More than they deserve. There was a werewolf on your property? Came in the night. Was gonna gut me. Sure as the ebb tide, but I caught it. Listen, you got that look in your eye. A hunter, just like me. Listen, you wanna come check out the mutt I caught? I got a rifle good for killing wolves that might be of interest. Have you had other run-ins with werewolves before? Me and Marie have been hunting them dogs ever since they tore up our town. They killed my sister. Oh my god, that vulture! <laughs> right on the porch. Coffee's still warm. The pain's like a wind across an empty plain. I can't forgive it. Not all werewolves are bad. Telling me you're a sympathizer? Only thing I hate more than them wolves is folks who protect them. You trying to tell me something? I'll come see the werewolf. Thought you might like to come. Any killer of them dogs is a friend of mine. Listen, come to my house. Yeah, dog hunters like us gotta stick together, eh, friend? Something like that. Damn. Well, she's not needing this anymore. It's fine. Oh! <laughs> Hey, deadbeat! That's my sister's pockets you're rooting around in! Fucking thief. She ain't even cold yet. I'll kill you for that. Get ready, scoundrel. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, let's restart this one then, because I do want to see what's at the house. Wait, wait, wait! Let him kill me! Let him... Damn it, it autosaved too. It's okay. We'll pick a previous autosave. 
from about a minute ago. That's fine. That was nice to see that it could happen. He didn't mind that I scrapped the weapon, only when I took the weapon. <laughs> but I wanna see the I wanna see the werewolf at the house. My house ain't far. Oh great! What a great autosave point. Uh, I'm gonna make a hard one here just in case. <laughs> you never know what's gonna go on. The sheriff. Kathy? What? We got a new sheriff! Maria! Hope it wasn't any trouble. Here's your reward. Oh, oh, for the bounties, which I don't even have any of? Okay, noted. Don't take it. So you want me to, um... Yeah, I'll go to your house. Where is your house? Lonely Oak. Just a main road. A small family, simple home. What if he's trying to lure me over, though? A lot of people seem to already know I'm a wolf, a werewolf, so that guy himself not knowing? I kind of don't trust that. No. Not one bit. I'm here for Layla! I'm here for Layla? Incredible, simply incredible. What? Oh! Scratches. The door! What a fury this creature was in! What could have triggered such a rage? Must have my calipers. The depth here and here. Height must be eight feet more. What are you doing? Measuring. What are you measuring? Ugh, must you distract me? Wolf markings. I'm a werewolf. You, 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 what? Hmm, you? A wolf person? Ah, yes, yes, yes! You have the smell, the canines. I've been aching to see one up close. I'll reward you. Yes, a reward. But not here, no. To expose. Meet me behind the general store. <laughs> okay. I'm just going around telling people I'm a werewolf. That works. Oh! Ah. Oh! She has a name now. Anais? Ah, passenger. Here searching for Layla, if I'm not mistaken. She's gone. Taken by the Anirists. Dead, perhaps. Who knows? I'm curious. If she were dead, wouldn't that be better? Death. There's peace in it, don't you think? Yeah, she- This girl doesn't like being immortal, clearly. You don't know that. Death is a mystery. <laughs> Indecisive questioning. Spoken like a true mortal. You know, whether or not this experiment works, it's all going to end. I'll see to that. See, the way she says, spoken like a true mortal, kind of makes me think that I am not mortal. What are you planning? What I'm planning? <laughs> Is that an attempt at, what, humor? It's what you're planning. You, not me. I'm at your mercy. All of the 21 are. What do you mean? Oh, well, I shouldn't say more than that. You'll know soon enough. What happened here? Your wolf friend, Layla. She was pulled here back to Grackle. Killed the woman in Town Square and took shelter in this house, her old home. The Anarvist's witches tracked her here, overpowered her, took her away. Where they went? Ah, uh, it's anyone's guess. Which way did they go? You know this. You always tell me. You're a wolf this time around, aren't you? Try sniffing around for tracks. They can't have gone far. Wait, what? The authority? You're the authority? Oh! So you're an iris then? Maybe her bangs are covering up her mark. 
the Anirist's mark. <laughs> Don't you have a moon drunk wolf to find? Oh, wow. But are they even going to address that? The Anirist leader is a immortal girl. That kind of makes sense. Oh, no. Blade was here. Trash the town, something awful. Sounds like them witches got to her first. Gotta pick up their scent. Anais should know exactly where they are then. Okay, I want the meat. What are you doing up there? The scent. Oh, tracking 0%. So there's footprints here. They go all the way to the back. Wait. Oh, this camp. This is new. Plague. Oh, it's the plague thing. Keep your distances. Yeah, but I want this. Free stuff, right? Thanks. You shouldn't have. You're much too kind. Okay, but not too much here. Just a nice bandages, which is really helpful. There's a quest- there's a side quest somewhere. Hold on, let me chase down the footsteps first. Wait, what? It just goes out. Oh, we have to track it like that. Okay. Well, then give me a second then, because I want to get my reward behind the general store. And somebody needs my help somewhere. Behind the general store. Still can't believe we're sharing territory with a lost fire. Don't need outsiders spreading the sickness here. What do you need? Probably got torn apart by a pack of plague zombies by now. Oh, sorry. Just worried about a shipment that was supposed to be here days ago. A case of bitters. Curse expensive one, too. Ordered it special from Absolution Hall. <laughs> My home? Okay, $60. Relay? Where were they? 20 days! Oh man, this is timed. I don't like those. Although 20 days is a extremely long time. Hey lady! Lady said I get a reward behind the general store. Oh my god! Okay, I'm not gonna turn into a werewolf in the middle of town. Whoa, lady, dude! Lady! Oh god, that's that's so horrific. Cause these zombies are people who were buried here before. Somebody's loved one. And we're just murdering them in cold blood. Again! Again! Where was the lady? It wasn't like a full-on quest, right? Lisa? Lisa Murphy? This is the general store? Is it not? No, this is the gun shop. The general store is... This one. I'll meet you behind the general store. Lisa? Yo, oh hey! Uh... You're not gonna hurt me, right? Yes! Here, yes! Show me... The creature. Oh look, she's vibrating! Okay. I only do it for the ladies. By the... By the spirits! Yevon and Nun, you... You're by the Shepherd Gavin himself! You're a marvelous sight! Your coat! Yes! The sheen, the claws, your eyes, the, your tail. May I measure you? 
Okay. Yes? Oh my. Hold out your arms? There? Yes, don't mind the cord, only for measuring. And your tail? Incredible, incredible. And now, may I? Your teeth? Length of the fangs, the jaw. Oh, is that growling? Oh my, you're something to behold. Here, as promised, a token. There is something else you could help me with. N no sexual favors. What? Lycanthropy. It is mysterious, difficult to research, dangerous, secretive. I've learned, though, that engraved silver daggers are tied somehow to the transformation process. If you can bring me one of these daggers, I will reward you handsomely. I base my research out of Cedar Flats. If you ever find one of the engraved silver daggers, find me there. Help the scientist. Well, okay. Silver daggers. We'll see you back in Cedar Flats if I ever find an engraved silver dagger. Not necessarily something I can control, so we'll have to see. Okay, let's get out of town. We got a track to follow. How is- wait, my inventory? I want to sell stuff at the general store first. Hey, you look like Lisa Murphy. Are you related? Juliana Murphy? Are you related to that lady? I get some supplies, friend, in case that wolf returns. Yeah, yeah. Fantastic. Don't sell that one, that's Monty. Monty's thing. Lockpicks? Always buy those. We got a good bit of money again. Okay. Hey, I feel like the wolf journey is already... Yeah, I like it. I like it more than the protector one already. Feels like there's more stuff going on. These side quests. The nature of being a wolf. Because I guess being a werewolf just has so many mysteries associated with it, naturally. Okay, go to the guy's house. You gonna try to kill me or what? I didn't loot your sister. There's a wolf right here! Wolf? So you've got a werewolf here? He's using the loo. You have a pigment here! You humans are dropping like flies lately. You came. Want a whiskey? Wait, no. Nah, we can drink after. Got something you'll want to see. In fact, I think I got a fine rifle with your name on it, if we're gonna be pals. Come on, friend. So, I'm, I'm here to rescue my friend, right? Let's make a save. <laughs> I, uh, I think I want to rescue somebody here today. Hmm. We can knock the guy out. Can you believe this shit? Caught it prowling through the corn a few nights back. Killed livestock. Would have gutted me in my sleep too, if I hadn't caught her. It's Flora again. <laughs> they have to be a little bit careful about not reusing important portraits. No! I was coming to talk to... I wasn't gonna hurt no one. My parents is dead as a dog's like you. My sister now too. It's time you got put down. Wait, can it be... Devotee Desiderio? That you? Oh, by the spirits it is! You've gotta help me! My friend here ain't one of you. Quit trying to fraternize. Devotee Desiderio, Francisca sent me here to talk sense into this fella. He's been hunting down our devotees and slaughtering them. You gotta believe me. Now hold on. You all sound too familiar for comfort. Be straight with me, friend. Is this mutt here right? You one of them dogs? 
No. No. No, no. See, Mutt? My friend here has got blood in his eyes. Ain't no you from Gavin. So what do you say, friend? A little target practice? Might not bring my sister back, but it might plug up the hole she left behind. Devotee the scenario! You've gotta stop him! Get shut up, I'm trying to get you out of there. On my count, let's see who can draw first and kill this mutt. Oh! I was planning on knocking you out. Um. Damn it. Okay, that didn't turn out the way. Oh, damn it. Whoa! He's talking a whole bunch. No, I want to save the. I want to save her. Yeah, I wanted to knock him out, but no, you have to kill him. There's no other way around this. Okay, I think I think we'll reload this one too. Oh my god! Yeah, maybe we should be a little bit more not afraid of experimentation. Just... Yeah. Reload. For the purposes of recording stuff, I don't really like saves coming too much because I feel like it wrecks the flow sometimes, but it is nice to see some alternate outcomes, right? What if I just ignore him? Can I stun him somehow? Because I can pick lock the door. We've got to hurt him. Is there another way we can do this? I can't knock him out. No, if I say I'm a wolf, he's gonna kill me. I'm sorry, dude. Yeah. I wasn't taking note earlier, but the quest, I guess it fails if we let her die, right? I think it failed earlier. Wait, I gotta- I gotta let go of my- sorry. <laughs> Ooh, his arm came off. I didn't want to kill him, because it's- I know he killed a lot of our people. But we killed his people too. That's the truth. The key! Okay, okay. Devotee Desiderio. Thought there for a second you were gonna... Well, I'm just glad you didn't. I gotta get back to the spirit hall. My Sophia. She must be sick worrying over me. I owe you my life. Oh! You were the flora lady! Back at Absolution Hall! You're Sophia, you're... Okay, okay. Yeah, he's got a rifle. Meantime, come and pay me and Sophia a visit at the Spirit Hall, alright? She's gonna want to thank you too. I thought you were missing Sophia. Damn. Well, we did a good thing, apparently. Our reputation did increase. But I kinda- I do kinda feel bad about you, so I will... I will bury you. His sister did die. And that was Layla's fault. Oh, hey, silver knives. Oh, this guy was so into killing werewolves, man. It's not an engraved silver knife. Yeah, it's not engraved. So I'm not sure if the lady Lisa Murphy would want this. Well, that was interesting. Although I'm kind of curious why you have a pigman living in your house. It's March already. A cult attack on local mine. Spirit Hall attacked by werewolves. New threat. Sickness. A wolf of Gavin's hounds rescued from dire captivity and certain death. Do people normally know? Like, werewolves sound like they're a normalized thing here. Oh, maybe Gavin's Hounds is like the organization name. What it actually means is werewolf, but people just think it means like a normal group name.
Thanks. The pigman's not looking. He's farming. He doesn't mind. Whose house is this anyway? Do you guys... Oh no, was that pigman his partner? Are they... Are they like together? They could be. There's a knife here. No, 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 don't, don't equip that. Okay, good. I want the knife. Give me the damn knife. Is it fake? It might be. Oh, damn. Guess you can get away with really anything. <laughs> Hunter's journal. Each entry has a lock of wool fur clipped to it. Most are stained with blood. Last one was moon drunk by the end, howling mad, even with its claws broken, teeth pulled. Can't help remembering. She was like that too in the end. Spirits take Franciscus and his dirt sucking curs cures. My sister would have had a peaceful death in her own bed if he hadn't put those vile thoughts in her head. Oh! Wait, is his sister also a wolf? Kinda sounds like it. Yeah, you won't be needing this anymore. Take it off your hands. Okay, maybe that's horrible enough of me. Let's go. Look at the way these buildings are designed, though. It's made so that you can walk around and do whatever you want. Go out the window. Go out the front door. Do whatever you want. Hi, I, I was just... Yeah. Uh, you might want to check the basement sometime. Alright. The Aniris track is this way, so I guess we can get the Crate of Bitters along the way. 19 days left? Well, we can do it right now. Oh my god. I'll fight anything. I'll fight a cave terror. What is... Oh, this must be... Yeah, this is a plague-related one, right? What we're really interested in is that one crate in the middle there. If I can get it and sort of, like, run away in something, like, that might work. Actually, maybe I'll just... Oh, God. Huiko! Wait, Huiko! Did you see that? Oh, no, we killed him already though, right? The guy that was a quick man, the guy that we dueled, his name was Huiko as well. Oh, forget this. Oh my god, check this out. Oh, but I'm weak against fire. Gotta be careful about that too. Oh god. We good? Thank you. Thank you for the assist, Joe. This here poet's got muscle. Let's use it. Oh, okay. So if people come save me, I can actually get them back in my posse again. But it's okay. It's okay. Damn, this whole place just got burnt. To the ground. So did I. Look at my health. We gotta be careful. Okay, we really gotta be careful here. I'm not... Oh my god, this zombie has Flora's face. <laughs> Everybody! His certain faces, they really can't... <gasps> what? Oh no. Wait, are these all people that we've seen before? Mary Murphy. Red Thunderbird. Across Rivers' cousin. No, oh, I do get the impression that that was the same person then. Oh. Crate. Okay, I gotta return it as well. Oh. Harold Jenkins, did I see you somewhere? What? David Long. Yes? Are you getting mad at me? For essentially stealing from dead bodies? Again? Oh. Yeah, that was a lot of zombies. 
Red Thunderbird. That's so messed up to say. Our cousin in another lifetime. Jennifer Jones. Oh, there's a whole bunch of people here. What the heck? They all have portraits. Oh my god. How about we try going to the tracking site first and then we'll go back to Grackle? We have 19 days. Shouldn't be too bad. The path leads through here. Hopefully you can find more clues to stay on the trail. Oh my god. I don't see any props today. You just want to talk? Hmm, I think I liked your old look better. Hello again, friend. You couldn't have shown up at a better time. I'm bored, as usual. But this time, I've come up with an amusing little game. I just need someone to play with me. And here you are. I call it the slap me if you can. The rules are simple. First one to successfully slap the other wins. Mortals love violence, right? Tell you what, if you can beat me at it, I'll even let you pick a reward from my chest. So, what do you say? Hurry on. How do I slap you, though? Great, let's do it. We're gonna have a hog killing time, you'll see. So as I said, first one to successfully slap the other wins. Deceptively simple, I know. And to give you a fair shake, I'll even let you go first. All right, I'm ready. Take your swing. Well, we know we can't hurt her. Left to right backhand. Okay. Oh, oh left to right backhand. Wow. Ah, missed me. I said it was simple, not easy. My turn now. Whoa. Oops. Guess I went a little hard on you. <laughs> Sorry. Don't feel too bad. Truth is, you're too slow to ever beat me. Because you're immortal. And you have immortal powers and instincts. But you know, if you ever feel like trying again, I'll be right here. In the meantime, thanks for relieving me of my boredom for a minute. This is immortal people problems. Wait. Did my health go down when she slapped me? No, right? So I can keep trying again. Immortal people problems. They get so bored that their plan to relieve their boredom is to slap people. Yeah, I don't think this will ever work. Your face might be sore for a while, but at least you'll have something to remember me by. Hmm. I'll try once more, but I really don't think this is even doable. She avoids the same way every single time. And then I just get slapped. Ugh. Gotta work on my speed, huh? Well, nothing for me today. Hmm. Let's go, guys. This witch is not worth talking to. Gregory? Yeah, stay away from the witch. She's evil. Probably. Everything's so much faster with a horse. Uh-oh. Walking dead. Plagued up people. There is a oil barrel, I think. The fire doesn't activate unless if I do something, right? I gotta... Ooh. Beautiful. Oh, damn! Damn, you got a good hidden on me just now. Maximo de Cueva. Hey, that's the lantern room. Yeah, the guy that we killed. Oh, these are all totally people we've killed before then. So this one might be like mixing in the plague event with a main story. Like, these plague zombies might not normally be here, I guess. 
Can you guys get the zombie, please? I'm a bit preoccupied. Yo, these guys hit hard. Yikes. They talk about weeks a lot. They always bring him up. Yeah. Be on the lookout for any portraits. Portraits are people that we know. Oleander Temple. That's perfect. Because we have to find SX's soul vessel there as well. Okay. Fantastic then. Let's get going. Hey, there's a there's a nest here. No. Oh. Alright. Am I my health is not okay. <laughs> it's not okay. But we have bandages. I'm just ninja, that's all. Oh, it's right back here. Tangling in your spine. Hairs on your neck stand up. Careful now. Animals? Wolves, though. They should be on my side. Why is my horse all the way over there? No, 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 no. No, I just wanted to eat the cactus. What the heck? That moose is going crazy. Oh, I've only got two arrows. Oh, no. When we go back to Grackle again, I've got to buy more. Yo, that, <laughs> that moose is going crazy. Hmm, there's an iris. Oh, there's a second person there. Three people on the outside. Will that person see me if I try to... Um, I get it, showing mercy. We should have just killed the bastard. It's not about killing or not killing them. It's about staying sneaky. Making ourselves hidden. Do you think I could just... Hold on. I do have the sentry silencer. Yes. Perfect. Oh, what the hell? There you go. When are you gonna give me a sigil stone? Moose, are you alright? You don't seem alright. No sigil stone here. I mean, I have one. I'm pretty sure I have a few. Guys? Take all this. Yeah, for now. Gotta be careful not to store too much on Gregory, though. Gregory might not be someone we'll see again. Lightning in a bottle? I haven't tried it too much. In a wet spot, I will. Okay, so as far as I can see, there are some other mooses... Meese? <laughs> Meese over there? But I... There's actually no sigil stone. I mean, I have one. Pretty sure I have a few. Can I just use the ones I have? Oh, I'm so sorry! Yes. What if you came here with no sigil stone? How would you get in? Okay, we'll go full werewolf once the situation demands it. For now, we'll try to lay low. Oh! Oh, sh! Damn it, that person was right there looking. I didn't even see them. Okay, I'm going around. 
Here we go. Did you die? Oh, yeah. Okay, we do have to be careful. Woo! Gregory, not doing so hot. Gregory, where are you? Y'all doing okay? Oh, damn! Someone just shot me like mad. Ooh, 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 I'm dying. One more person here? No law picks, though. Okay, well, that was the fastest way to do this. No problem. Did take a good few potions, just because of how chaotic that was. That was a complete misplay. <laughs> Anira's Tome. Being a record of the temple in the new land. We've begun the dig. The authority was right. There is great power in the depths of these in this cave system. Even the initiates can feel it now. We still don't know how deep it goes, but we found hewn walls, stone floors, doorways, all on a massive scale. We've had to build our own stairs just to navigate the lower levels. Who? Or what built this place? And why? Oh, I thought you guys built this place. No? Who built it, then? Disciples report. Ancient angular script. More geometry than language. Precious few mortals could understand it. Stained scroll. You heard right, kin. My temple was evacuated, too. We saved what we could, but too much was lost. And now only vermin and outlaws walk our sacred halls. Opportunistic squatters who moved in after Francisca's curse drove us out. Curse these undreaming wretches. Undreaming. We need to get past the door. So we probably need some kind of a key. Hmm, they were making... They were farming down here. Yeah, the, the amount of potions, the purple potions we have, just says keep changing into werewolf form whenever we can. That's probably the most efficient way to fight anyway. For melee! Yeah, but unfortunately, you can't really hold a gun as a werewolf. Nor would you really want to, I guess? Guess I can't sleep here. Not that kind of time. Okay, so we're- ooh. We're looking for Layla here. But there's a lot of anirists here. She was probably in that one spot that needed the key. But we're also looking for SX's soul vessel. So much acid here. Visions. Dreamings. Yeah. A lot of mumbo jumbo, really. Okay, there's a few people there. Maybe I'll check the back. Hey, everyone's really hurt. We don't have that many bandages. We need to be careful. People are tough, but that whole thing that we did was just way too reckless, probably. Is this the exit? Holy crap, this place is huge. Wait, you can't... You can't go through this. For now. Let's try to lay low if we can. Yeah, save the rifle shots for the sentry silencer. You guys looking at each other? Did 
And that's what I'm talking about. This is how you pray, you close your eyes. You're not looking at the person next to you when you're praying. Hmm. The wavy stuff, is it water? It's not water on the ground. It's just... some power stuff. Okay, yeah, they want me to go back here. This is actually, this actually needs a pick lock. Oh, Layla. Oh, that's gotta be Layla. Oh. Never mind. The other button. Could we shoot it? Not without people not knowing. Let's get that guy. Can I stab it with a knife? Unbreakable. Damn. Perfect. You're trying to let the whole West know? Dante Williams. Hey! You are friends of this here moon gazer? How about getting me the fuck out of this cage too? You let me out? I'll make it worth your while. T tell me more. Tell me more. That witch has got the key. Care to get me the fuck out of this hole? Oh, you wanna know why I'm in here? What do you want me to say? I'm a thief. Onira's artifacts go over a high price of the right bidder. In fact, I happen to know of a particular artifact that got hidden here that'll fetch a fortune. Something called the Soul Vessel. Let me out, and I'll tell you where to find it. I'm gonna guess it's probably beyond that wall, that fake wall earlier. Maybe we just had to blow it up with dynamite. Note of warning. Wolf is dangerous, already mauled one of ours. Signs of being moon drunk, use caution. The steels. Somnolence itself was discovered only through the careful translations of the ancient runes upon the steels. Stells? It seems only logical to assume that more of these standing stones the ancients erected must yet remain undiscovered. These things weren't made by the people here, these temples. These anirists? Tougher than a cave terror I am, are you really? Okay, I'll let you out, but you you better come up before she does, because I don't know what she's going to do. Thank floods. Thought I was fucked good and hard that time. Well, Moongazer, guess I owe you my thanks. How do you know I'm a Moongazer? How about that soul vessel as payment? There's a switch on the wall near that big incense burner. Ain't just smoke over there, huh? Wish I could say my thieving days are over, but they ain't. See you around, Moongazer. Incense. You could recover some... <laughs> Sorry, Layla. Recover some AP, but everyone's really hurt. We gotta be careful. You guys have bandages, right? Oh, you used yours. Have one. Everyone have one. Did I go so hard both of them use their bandages? That's pretty bad. We gotta be careful, careful. Next time we see cactuses, we're chugging them. Uh, you know what? Oh, this is so cruel, but... I'm just scared. You're not gonna teleport me away, right? Okay. Because I still need to find the soul vessel. Layla. <sighs> Layla. Layla. <sighs> Fucking floods. My head. Oh. Hey, friend. I take it from your look, I've been a bad dog. Shit. Been a while since I've been that moon drunk. 
Them witches nabbed me from town and, oh, oh no, 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 Blood Moon Temple. They figured out we're headed there. Come on, we gotta get back to Franciscus. Got a feeling we'll need a few more bad dogs like me if we want to get in that temple now. Them witches got the Blood Moon Temple location out of Layla. Job just got harder. Franciscus will know what to do. Oh, nobody knows where it is. I thought they knew. I thought the Anirists knew, and we were trying to get through, and they were trying to guard it the whole time. Let's get back to the Spirit Hall. We need to talk with Franciscus. Murdered an entire temple for my one friend here. Worth it. Oh yeah, we need all the health we can get. We're on hard mode now. No! So much for all the health I can get. Where's your food? Don't you guys keep food around here? Gonna get cursed hanging around here. Don't say that. The soul vessel. Near the big incense burner, there is a switch. Have I been here? Oh. Yeah. Well, there we go. More importantly, some bandages. Please and thank you. <gasps> sure. There's a witch's journal. The words are scrawled in an ancient angular script. Can't understand it. Oh, more bandages. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's their sleeping quarters. They won't be needing any of this anymore. Another one? Ink-stained journal. Another day of drudgery, spirits of sake. Did I really trade in one kitchen for another? Then I leave home and swear myself to the temple just to be cutting up more vegetables. Well, at least I've got my little hiding spot behind the burning sensor. Don't know how I'd find the time to study the tombs otherwise. Another hint. For the soul vessel. That's food, right? I know it's empty. You can still be absolved. Sweetheart, please come home. I know we parted on rough terms, but I still love you. The kids still love you. They want their mama back. I talked to the clerics, and if you come home before it's too late, we can still set you right with the spirits. Just please come home. Yeah, the West in general, they don't like the Anirists. Who are you? You were already dead when I came here. Guess they were trying to heal you. Me oh, you were the one that Layla hurt. Yeah, that makes sense. Thank you. I'm good, but my friends aren't. Oh god, this is water next to the loo. Ooh. The incense burner. Wait. Is this the big incense burner? You can bring up an entire slab. There's a switch next to... The big incense bur- You can see- wait, you can see! Behind! There's a switch next to the big incense burner. No, there's a ceiling. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, that's magic! That's magic. Thank you very much. What is that circle? Here we go. Good, we got it. We're all good. Thank you to that guy, otherwise I wouldn't have noticed this spot. The other spot probably just had- I think it just had people, but eh, you wanna check it anyway? Sure, okay. But I don't want to get hurt, though. If there's gonna be fighting, I think we should stay away. I know I have eight bandages, but that might not be enough in the heat of the moment, you know? 
This one's different. Oh, there's werewolves there. Oh, we definitely should go then. I don't know how you're supposed to get... Oh, 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 guys. Oh, no, we should go, we should go. We don't even know how to get behind that. I don't want to deal with it. Especially when you guys are a little bit lower on health. Guys, let's go, Gregory! Oh boy, oh. Hey, there's a green one. Well now, you survived them witches, eh, Moongazer? And got the soul vessel besides. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. You are the marked wolf after all. So, you gonna hand it over, friend? Well, let's not make it that easy for him. Why shouldn't I keep the vessel myself? Hold on now, friend. The experiment that the 21 are doing? They need all of them to make it happen. Think about it. If I take over Aleph's body, then I stop whatever it is they're planning. What's more, friend or not, I ain't gonna let you take what's mine. You leave with that vessel, and we're gonna have a problem. You understand me? Beg for it. Serious? All right, fine. Please, will you hand it over? You happy? <laughs> okay. Never thought I'd find it. Here's that nymph relic I promised. Useful suckers. Immortality's calling, friend, and I'm close enough to hear it. <sighs> Why are you so intent on becoming immortal? Why won't you give up? Give up? Friend, I don't think you understand. It ain't that I won't give it up. I can't. Seeing Kit die, the whole top came off the world. Whatever part of me thought death might be all right left for good. So you gotta understand, I won't quit. Not the 21, not Aleph, not even you'll keep me from getting what I want. You can be sure of that. Well, wanting immortality might be a... It's a pretty standard thing that some types of people might want without any sort of external reason anyway. Did you kill all the wolves here? They're all gone. 